Expectations are building that North Korea is preparing a rocket launch as early as this weekend. Activities been picked up at the North's Sohe Satellite Launching Station, ironically by commercial satellite imagery, as cited by the North Korea-focused American website 38 North this week. You can clearly see blue materials laid in a Y shape on a coastal launch pad, based on imagery dated March 23rd, 2024. According to 38 North, that material covers a 125 meter stretch of tarmac and is apparently the same material that's been used to wrap other things at the site, such as tanks, for example. 38 North said the material's purpose around the launch pad is unclear, but that the pad likely remains ready to use when needed. And also earlier this week, a South Korean military source indicated that the North is making necessary preparations for the launch of a reconnaissance satellite based on the movement of personnel and equipment that's been detected at Sohe Satellite Launching Station. And it's thought North Korea may be trying to beat South Korea to launch its second spy satellite as the two Koreas appear to be engaged in a space race. Three. South Korea's defense ministries confirmed that the South will likely be seeking to launch its second spy satellite in early April, which means as soon as next week. Having successfully placed its first ever spy satellite into orbit late last year via a SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket launched from California, the South will this time be launching one from Florida. But in the face of global condemnation, for defying UN Security Council resolutions, North Korea got there first with its first successful spy satellite launch late last year, following two failures. And it's thought the North may try to launch its second within this month. The country's stated aim is to launch three spy satellites this year. That said, South Korean Defense Minister Shin Won-shik recently renewed question marks over North Korea's satellite capabilities claiming there are no signs that the North's first spy satellite is actually working properly other than simply going around. By comparison, the South's confident in its own advancement, planning to have five spy satellites in orbit by next year, potentially capable of monitoring locations in North Korea every two hours.